everybody, this is your tarot reading for Tuesday, the 28th of June, and I'm using the Universal Goddess Tarot today, which I got secondhand at a shop here in Glastonbury. So I've never used these cards before. I do. I'm not a big proponent of cleansing cards and having little rituals and stuff, but right now, for whatever reason, I'm being told to knock on them three times, and I always listen to guidance like that. It's, there's no rhyme or reason, and when people tell you these prescriptive things, you have to um, dance around them eight times on, you know, uh, during the silver light of the new moon, whatever. Don't take that too seriously. These are just tools to help you tune into your intuition. People get hung up on the ritual stuff. Okay, so this is the Universal Goddess Tarot. Let's have a look at what's coming up for you today by these beautiful cards. The first card is the Two of Pentacles, and the Two of Pentacles represents handling situations, juggling, lots of stuff going on. Usually, it's usually represented by this juggler and real ups and downs in life. Here we've got the sun and the moon, a full moon when they're opposed like that. Things coming to fruition. Ups, downs. There's a lot going on. There are high highs, low lows, and really, it shows me that the day is very, very changeable. And, you know, on, on very changeable days, you have a great hour at 8, then some crisis happens at 9, which is resolved by 10, then you get information at 11. It can be a lot, and that's what I'm getting for this day. The next card is the Magician. So what that says is, do not, please, forget your role in it and your ability to create and to harvest and to really make things happen. So if you're just responding the whole day to things going on, don't forget about your own agenda, about the things that you want to do, because you still have a lot, a great deal of personal power within all of this activity. Finally, we've got the King of Pentacles. It's beautiful here. It looks a lot like Lakshmi in this deck. And the King of Pentacles is financial prosperity, physical prosperity, like your health but it's interesting because here we've got pentacles here we've got the harvest and here we've got coins again so this is a good day for money okay so there may be ups and downs financially if you look at what's going on in the world uh the pound being what it is um with with the brexit thing that happened recently the pound has really dropped actually for you guys that is very helpful if you want a reading with me because it's not going to cost you as much these days because the pound has dropped so that's helpful um but if you look at it in the context of this readings reading there are lots of ups and downs okay despite all of these ups and downs you have a lot of potential to create wealth to create abundance for yourself harvest the things that you've been working on despite what is going on despite uncertainty and really realize that your experience you're skilled and you have um, a great deal of expertise that you can use to create real abundance and wealth in your own life. So basically the message is don't let yourself be dictated to via the world's events on this day. Remember your own power and create wealth and abundance and prosperity in your own life. And also, as I always say, pentacles refer to your belongings, but they can also represent the body, physical things. Okay, so if there's lots of stress and activity, remember you can create good health for yourself by investing in yourself, by doing something that you know makes you feel good, yoga, exercise, walking in nature, and you can reap the rewards of that activity on this day. So number-wise, we have got two, and one is three, and one is four, and four is about stability and security and structure. So regardless of all the turmoil in the world at the moment, or personally, or the stress that's going on in your office or at home. Don't worry about that so much. Things are stable, and things are much more solid and reliable than you realize. So don't buy into all of the hype of everything is up in the air. I hope you have a wonderful Tuesday. If you'd like a private reading with me, please get in touch via my website. It's gregoryscott.com. Click on the readings tab, and you can order your reading with me there. Please remember to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Very important. And I also do live readings on Facebook. It's facebook.com forward slash Gregory Scott 444. Like that page and uh, you'll be notified when I'm on. Have a wonderful day and I'll speak to you tomorrow.